Well, it's known as the Final Frontier, and what better way to study it than here in the Land of Enchantment? One New Mexico company is doing just that, preparing to utilize their technology to provide better insights for nearly 60,000 feet in the air. News 13's Gabe Chavez caught up with the research company Sky as they prepare to brand expand their work. We're a, a fast-growing company and we will be expanding in New Mexico. Eight years running in New Mexico, Sky, an aerospace and research company, has been growing strong in the state. The overall mission for Sky is, is to take that vast, untapped area between drones and satellites, and uh, which is generally known as the stratosphere, and uh, turn that into a, a force for good. The company launches four different flights a year for their HAPS blimps. The way that our HAPS functions is aerodynamically shaped, uses helium for buoyancy, solar panels for daytime, and battery for nighttime. The flights all used to test their capabilities and help them take the next steps in their research. The most recent flight tested the blimp's ability to fly day and night thanks to solar-powered batteries in the stratosphere. So this is about uh, uh, controlled relocation, building evidence of our ability to stay over an area of operation. The company moved to New Mexico nearly eight years ago and has been doing flights out of Roswell since 2021. The company says they have been able to help find methane leaks from oil and gas sites and even provide broadband connectivity to some areas. Recently, the company received a multi-million dollar investment they say will help them take things to the next level. The uh, HAPS industry is a far more scalable uh, alternative uh, to satellites. As the company continues to grow, they are planning further expansion in New Mexico, hoping to be a major contributor to the local economy. Also start um, uh, opening up for um, seasonal uh, customers and so thereby doing our first step into a commercial operation. Gabe Chavez, KRQE, News 13. Sky says next year, their main focus for their test flights will be the endurance of the blimps, testing to see how long they can keep them operational in the stratosphere.